A Salem hospital is facing a class action lawsuit after hundreds of patients may have been exposed to hepatitis and HIV. And for the first time, one of the potential victims is talking about the moment she learned that she might have been exposed to those infections, sharing her fear and frustration with WBZ's Beth Germano. My brain went into 800 different places. And I literally just could not stop trying to figure it out. Melinda Cashman's reaction when she received a letter from Salem Hospital late on a Friday afternoon, November 3rd, telling her she may have been exposed to a virus and no ability to immediately follow up. Was I going to end up needing a kidney or a liver transplant? Was I going to begin an infection that was going <laughs> to require me to not be around anymore? And I'm the sole caregiver for my parents. She's one of 450 patients notified by the hospital that a single instrument used during an endoscopy procedure may have been used multiple times, exposing her to hepatitis or HIV. And now she's part of a class action lawsuit. The hospital has a duty to be open with the patients to talk to them about why this happened, how this happened, for how long it's been going on. How long has the hospital known it's been going on? The hospital admits the problem had been going on for two years before it was corrected, but insists there's no evidence to date of any infections. Melinda Cashman insists she can't even interpret the test results she got and can't get clarification from her doctor, especially after a telehealth appointment was canceled. My stress level went from overwhelmed to straight up anger. Like, why would you not pick up the phone? The suit claims the hospital has not been transparent with patients and aims to get answers, including how to prevent the mistake from happening again. They're upset, they're, they're anxious, and they have questions that we intend to seek answers uh, to in this lawsuit. The law firm says it has now been contacted by several patients ranging in age from 21 to their 70s. The hospital says it is aware of the suit and is reviewing it. In Milton, I'm Beth Germano, WBZ News.